dress and cuties waiting here. Today we're going to draw a cute puppy inspired by the secret life of pets. So let's get started. To draw this adorable puppy, let's first start by drawing its eyes. So I'm going to come right here and draw a really big circle. Because that's how you make your puppies really cute, right? Your big eyes and big noses. And then I'm going to come right next to it, not too far apart, say about right there. And I'm just going to draw another big circle. There, so now I got two big circles in. I'm going to come back in here and I'm going to draw another circle inside towards this edge more. So let's go ahead and say about right here. I'm just going to draw this another circle in here. I just want to give a little bit of white space. So right here as well. The nice thing about draw so cute eyes is it's easy to adjust, right? So then from there, we're going to make them draw so cute eyes. I'm going to come in here, with two smaller circles for highlights, and then a curved line at the bottom and shade in the top. And lines at the bottom. And same thing over here. So the reason I'm drawing this puppy for you is because I just went to Universal Studios and I went to the um, Secret Life of Pets ride just to check it out. It was so cute and there was this little poster here of this little puppy and I just felt I had to draw this for you because it was just so cute and it looked pretty simple enough. So hopefully I'm going to be able to help you out with this video if you want to draw puppies. Okay, so now we have these two huge eyes in. Let's go ahead and draw the even bigger nose. So right underneath the eyes, very close to it, I'm gonna go ahead and just draw this curve right underneath, right in the center. And then from there, I'm gonna round it off for this gigantic nose. Of course, it's exaggerated because we want it to be extra cute. So I'm just going to round it off, just kind of like drawing an oval almost. And then I'm going to bring it to the center, about right there, and then go right back up. But if you want to just draw like a basic oval, that's fine too. It doesn't really matter. I just want this big shape right here. And then I'm going to come right here and draw a big, long oval for a highlight. And I'm going to shade this all in. So I guess you could look at it as this puppy is looking at you exaggerated, like the nose is right up in your face. <laughs> so that's why it's so big. <laughs> now I'm running out of ink here, my Sharpie. Hopefully not. And yes, I definitely do go through a lot of Sharpies. And so thank goodness they're pretty inexpensive compared to other um, black marker pens. And they're pretty reliable. So that's why I use them to show you how to draw in these videos. Okay, so now I have this huge nose in. I'm going to come and go ahead and frame the face. So let's come to this um, to the center of your eye. Let's come out just a little bit, say about right here, and same thing on this side. From there, I'm going to go ahead and draw a slight angle line down on both sides. So I'm going to go around and draw this long face, and we're going to start to round it off about right here around the nose for some cheeks. And same thing here. And then let's go ahead and just connect it at the bottom of a curve. So we're just going to keep bringing this down. Not too far, just a little bit underneath the nose. And draw the shallow curve all the way. There. So nice and round, giving it some cheeks here at the bottom. And then we're going to bring it up. So it's narrower at the top. Just go up 
and not too high either just say about right here just find my center I just say about right here then connect and once again come right back down there so we have the face shaped in and then at the top right here we're going to draw this curve right here to give our puppy even more personality so just draw this curve right here for the brow to make it extra cute and then um, let's draw let's see here let's let's draw the body first before we work on the ears so let's come about right here and here nice and center and I'm going to pop out this collar so I'm just going to draw this little curve right here from there I'm going to go ahead and connect it so right underneath I'm just drawing this curve come towards the center and go right back up there and then I'm going to thicken up our collar all the way just thicken it up there got that collar in and then now we can go ahead come in a little bit and we're going to draw the body so we're just going to bring in a curve on both sides then let's say about right here I'll just give myself a point right here kind of like where the chest will end I'll draw a little curve right in the center and from there I'm going to bring out two curves to start the front legs so let's bring this down a little bit more short little legs right because it's a super cute puppy so we're going to bring this down come down in a little bit more and then about right there I'm going to stop and pop out the curve for the paw and then just go ahead and connect and then come right back in here and we're just going to draw two curves so it's the same thing on this side right there and pop out and connect and then once again two curves there and then in between whatever space you have left about right here you just go ahead and draw a curve and then for the back we're just going to make it very tucked in so let's say about right here just going to slight curve and then just bring it in and then curve it out for the back paw back feet and then you can even add a curve right there so same thing on the other side about right here not too much so just a little bit and then bring it in just like the other side and then curve it out and tuck in and if you have enough space you can add a little curve right there okay and then now the ears that makes it extra cute right so let's come right here but in this area I'm just going to draw these floppy puppy ears I'm going to bring it all the way down and we're just going to tuck it in so about right here maybe I'll dip it in a little bit and then come back out just a little subtle detail and then just tuck it in about right here so same thing on the other side So about right here you can start to tuck it in a little bit and then bring it out and once again I'm just going to end about the same area on the other side and tuck it in <laughs> there and let's see last but not least let's add a tail so right in here and pop out this tail round off the tip and bring it in and of course we wouldn't be complete without a heart right so right here on the collar let's give our puppy this beautiful heart collar right here it's chain and then i'm just going to add a line right there and i'm just going to add some stripes to this collar i'm going to add a lot of colors to it or you can just make it one color but the stripes would just give it some texture and that is pretty much it for this cute little puppy that um, was in, oh well actually you know what um, I was thinking what do you think maybe we should give our puppy a little smile if you don't want to um, you can just leave it like this but I just feel like it needs something right so if you want to let's see how this looks like maybe we're right here Ooh, 
come here and then just give it a little smile just a half extra cute <laughs> hopefully you think so so add it if you think it looks extra uh, better and um, i really hope i helped you draw this cute puppy inspired by the secret life of pets thanks so much for watching and if you loved it please make sure to give me a like and subscribe so you won't miss any new draw so cute videos see you later